Hello. Today we're going to be practicing a meditation to reverse any negative attitude, frustration, or depression. And I'm working out of this book called Meditations for Addictive Behavior, a system of yogic science with nutritional formulas. This little gem I got about, I don't know, 10 years ago. And it's been a really long time since I've practiced this, but it's, um, it's really a wonderful meditation. And um, unlike uh, the yin or restorative, instead of settling in, we're gonna shake it up and then we're gonna pause, and then we're gonna shake it up again. Um, each segment is going to be three minutes long. I highly recommend you get as comfortable as possible, whether that means sitting on a pillow, a blanket, a bolster, even sitting in a chair. You don't need to sit on the floor to do this and to have it be effective. So um, the first part we're going to have our hands, palms facing each other, fingers are together, and we wanna remain a, a stiffness or a tightness in our hands. We're gonna be inhaling as we bring our hands close in together, exhaling as we bring them out. And it's a very sharp, strong motion. We're gonna be doing that seven times, and on the eighth time, we're gonna bring our hands together. So it's inhale, exhale, inhale. And then on eight, clap, all right? We're gonna begin that for three minutes. And then in the next three minutes, we're going to be holding the stillness. Okay, here we go. Last round. Hold the stillness. Bring your hands to your knees, palms open. Close your eyes and just feel the energy moving through the body, releasing all that tension you're creating. Find the stillness.
embrace the silence. I challenge you to try not to move. And just focus on your breath. We're now in part two of the three-part meditation. holding here for a couple more minutes. Close your eyes. Maintain a nice straight spine, heart center lifted, shoulders down and relaxed. Try not to let your mind get lost and busy. If you're finding things popping into your mind, acknowledge them on the inhale. Let them go on the exhale. Placing them on a cloud that's going to get blown away from you. Or imagining that thought as a leaf in the river watching it wash away, keeping your mind clear, clean, and empty. As you continue to focus on your breath and an empty, calm mind. for the final section of this meditation. We're going to be holding the Moody Mudra, so thumb and pinky finger are gonna touch. Try not to let your fingernails touch, just the pads of your fingers. The three fingers are gonna be touching, palms are down, and you're going to be circling these hands as fast as possible away from you in an outward, forward motion. Move as fast as you can. This movement always has reminded me of like a, what is that called? A speed bag or speed ball. Working it out, we're releasing frustration, really go for it. Move that energy, drop that negativity. This is the make it or break it. How bad do you want it? That's how fast you should be moving those hands. You should feel that breeze coming in your face. Faster, faster, faster. Rolling away from you. Outward motion. Keep breathing, keep rolling those arms. If you're caught up in that negative mindset and so much frustration, anger, tension, depression. This is your opportunity to release it. We're almost there. Keep going. Stay 
Stay strong. Try not to give up. Keep rolling. up and just take a moment to feel the effects of the meditation. Notice any shifts in how you're feeling. Notice any changes that may or may not have occurred in this short nine minute practice. deep. Exhale, bring your hands together and thank you for trying this meditation with me. I hope it helps. And if the three minutes per segment just feels like too much, feel free to start with one minute per segment and then you can build up to two and then finally have three or you can go for it. Thank you.